hello you're welcome how to solve this nice exponential equation solution from what we have here from a raised to power x equals to 96 here let's take the log on both sides and we have log a raised to power x equals to log 96 from here then when we apply the power law of logarithm from when we have log m raised to power p which is equals to p log m that is here this becomes x log 8 equals to log 96 the next step here we divide both side by log 8 that is divided by log 8 and also this side by log 8 then here log 8 cancel each other you are left with x which is equals to log 96 over log 8 then from what we have here we can write 96 as 8 times 12 then what we have here becomes x equals to log 8 times 12 divided by log 8. Then when we apply the law of logarithm from log a times b which is equals to log a plus log b then here this becomes x equals to log 8 plus log 12 divided by log 8 and here we can separate this fraction into two fractions that is here we have x equals to log 8 over log 8 then plus log 12 over log 8 that is here log 8 cancel each other this give us 1 then we have x equals to 1 plus log 12 over log 8 then also from here 12 can be written as 4 times 3 that is here we have x equals to 1 plus log 4 times 3 here then over log 8 and also when we apply the law of logarithm here this becomes x equals to 1 plus log 4 plus log 3 then over log 8 then also this fraction can be separated into two fractions that is here we have x equals to 1 plus log 4 over log 8 then plus log 3 over log 8 then also from here this can be reduced further here yeah. we can write 4 as 2 times 2 which is 2 squared and also 8 can be written as 2 times 2 times 2 which is equal to 2 raised to power 3 that is here we have x equals to 1 plus log 2 squared over log 2 cube plus log 3 over log 2 cube from here that is now we apply the power of logarithm 2 here can come here also 3 here comes here and we have x now equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 over 3 log 2 plus 
log 3 over 3 log 2 that is from here log 2 cancel each other and what we have left can be written as x equals to 1 plus 2 over 3 here yeah? then plus here we can separate this as 1 over 3 times log 3 over log 2 and also from here we can rewrite this from change of base that is from log a over log b which is equals to log a to base b then we have x now equals to 1 plus 2 over 3 that's same thing as 5 over 3 then plus 1 over 3 log 3 base 2 from here so here we can also rewrite this and this will be x equals to 5 plus log 3 base 2 over 3 so here we have the value of x in this problem as 5 plus log 3 base 2 over 3 now let's check if this satisfy the given problem from what we have here we can substitute the value of x here and this becomes 8 raised to power 5 plus log 3 base 2 over 3 here is equals to 96 then we can rewrite 8 here as 2 raised to power 3 to multiply itself three times then multiply by 5 plus log 3 base 2 then over 3 is equals to 96 from here then since this power multiply 3 can cancel each other here and we are left with 2 raised to power 5 plus log 3 base 2 is equals to 96 from here that is here when we follow the law of indices from a raised to power m plus n which is equals to a raised to power m times a raised to power n what we have here now becomes 2 raised to power 5 times 2 raised to power log 3 base 2 is equals to 96 from here and then here we have 2 raised to power 5 to multiply itself 5 times which is 32 then times here this follows from a raised to power log b to base a which is equals to b that is here this is 3 and is equals to 96 here then of course 32 times 3 that gives us 26 which is equals to 96 now the left hand side equals to the right hand side and hence from here we can conclude that x equals to 5 plus log 3 base 2 over 3 satisfies this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget this step subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on share this video give it a thumbs up and put your comments in the comment section. See you next class and bye for now.